Hello everyone, welcome back to the Outdoor Learning Channel. Um, it's all fun and well exercising and keeping fit and healthy, which is good. Um, but we also need to exercise our brain and our mind. To do that, we can use different puzzles, different challenges, jigsaws or stuff like that. Um, we are going to build Towers of Hanoi, which is a mathematical puzzle. So that's what it's going to look like at the end. Come over this way, I'll show you how to make it. All right, to build this, you will need a cereal box, some extra cardboard that we're going to cut out, a pen, a couple of pencils, some scissors, different sized circular objects that you can use to cut out shapes, or a compass if you have one. Using your different sized objects, draw five circles. You can do more, or if you have a compass, different sized circles. Once you've done that, remove. And you can see we have five different sized circles and we are now going to cut them out. Might need an adult for this one. All right, getting the help of an adult, we are then going to start cutting our circles out. As close to the line as we can. Using a pencil to mark the center. Again, you definitely need an adult to, to do this. We are then going to pierce a hole in the center. Mind your fingers on the back. And from there, we can stick our pencil in and make make the hole big enough so that the pencil can go through. Once you've got all of your circles cut out, you can decorate them in any color as you wish. I've used some tape. You can paint them, you can use crayons, you can just number them. It's up to you what way you use it. But once you've got them all done, we are ready to move on to the next step. Right, um, using your cereal box lengthways, mark a couple of points on it as far away so one in the center, one on either end. We are then going to grab a pencil and gently just push it in. One here. And the last one goes here. We now have our little towers of Hanoi that we can place all of our pieces on top. The aim of the puzzle is to move all of the pieces from their starting position on the first pencil to one of the other two pencils. However, there are rules. All right, so now our puzzle piece is complete. Um, to do the puzzle, there's three rules that we need to pay attention to. Firstly, you can only move one piece at a time. The second rule is once you move a piece, it has to go onto one of the other pencils. And the last rule is big ones cannot go on top of small ones. They have to go somewhere else. Once you've done that, you can try and solve the puzzle. And there we have our Towers of Hanoi. This uh, puzzle was created by a French mathematician called Edouard Lucas in 1883. To make it easier, start with three pieces, um, and that can be done in seven moves. The least amount of moves it can be done in. To make it harder, add two more pieces I'm not going to tell you what the least amount of moves for that is, you're going to have to figure that out yourself. I hope you enjoy this, and if you complete it, try and challenge your parents, or your friends, your aunts and uncles, and if you find five too easy, add more. Uh, thank you very much, and take care.